Yeehaw! My favorite burger from Burger King is back! Hey, what's good, Schmack Pack? We are back at the King of Burgers. Self proclaimed because I don't think anyone actually agrees with that. And if you do, maybe you're in another country because in Mexico, Burger King's pretty on point. But! They brought back my favorite dollar menu item, although it's a dollar twenty-nine. Although I guess some places it is a dollar, so it depends. But I got it right here, the rodeo burger. I think it might have used to be a rodeo cheeseburger. Now that I think about it, cheese is extra now though. I don't know. I don't like cheese anyways. Whatever. But then I also got some fries up in this joint. It's a large fry apparently. Lukewarm fries, bro. All right. And then the burger. <laughs> it's probably gonna be exactly how I remember it. Cold. <laughs> but $1.29, let's see what we got. Mm. Sesame seed bun, pop the top. Load it up with barbecue sauce. Load it up with how many onions on here? Three bar th <laughs> three onion rings on uh on a once flame grilled burger. <laughs> yeah. You see, this, this this has that same exact smell as it did all those years ago. I'm kind of, I'm, I mean, I'm probably not going to come here to get it ever again, but I used to get this all the time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now let's see. <laughs> onion rings are pretty crispy. There's honestly too much bread in every bite. Dry bun too. Man, that's a dollar. The problem is I waited in line. Like the line was going so slow. I waited for like 10 minutes for this thing. And it still didn't make it fresh. What the hell's taking them so long? Yeah. How the hell can Mexico Burger King make everything amazing and fresh and delicious? But in the States, you get this. That's crazy. Good news is, load it up with barbecue sauce. I knew this, the bun's still dry somehow. And everything's just cold. Okay, the meat's starting to taste weird. I haven't really been able to taste the meat this whole time. But now, yeah.
Mm. There we have it. <laughs> uh huh. I don't think it's my favorite anymore. Uh, scale one to ten, Burger King's returning rodeo burger for $1.29. I gotta say it diddles. I mean, there's too much bun. Can't really taste the meat. Onion rings all right. Barbecue sauce is all right. And then the bun's really dry, so it makes the whole entire experience dry somehow, even though there's a bunch of barbecue sauce on it. I'm not sure how they do that. But it's also not up to temperature. Like, I get that it's a dollar, but come on, at least, at least pretend that it's hot. Like put it in the microwave or something, do something. I mean, have you ever eaten a cold burger? It's, it's, not, it's not what's up. It's not what's up. I mean, for dollar twenty nine, you know it's all right, but I kind of feel sick after eating that. It used to be one of my favorites. I mean, <laughs> I mean, you know, for as far as a dollar goes, but you know, it tastes about the same. Mm hmm. And then the fries. How, that's what I don't understand. I mean, I, well, at Burger King, I'm not sure because people don't like Burger King's fries, but you know, generally at a fast food place, they're making fries on stock because people are getting fries with their food. Somehow these fries are cold. And those aren't a dollar. The large is like three bucks. But then again, in Burger King, Mexico, fries are hot, crispy, delicious. Food's hot, crispy, yummy, delicious. They're supposed to be crispy. Yummy. But come on, in the States, they slack it, man. I can't wait for Burger King in the States to just become defunct. Thumbs up, right subscribe button. Get this merch, because it's better than Burger King. Social media, I'll see y'all in the next one.